Four minutes. That's how long an eastern Kentucky jailer says two inmates spent hitting corrections officers with broken broom handles during a daring attempted escape. The jailer in Bell County says the inmates held those officers hostage trying to trade them for freedom. But it didn't go according to plan. Josh Breslow has the LEX 18 Big Story update. It was around 9.30 last night when Bell County Dispatch got a call about two inmates trying to escape from the county jail. Those inmates were apparently holding two corrections officers hostage. While a jail employee made that frantic call for help, cameras inside captured the violent situation unfolding. This picture, the jailer says, shows 26-year-old inmate Christopher Dixon, a man charged in a machete attack, holding a broken broom handle, his weapon of choice last night, the jailer says. Uh, they're beating my officers to death. Okay, how many, how many are there? There's a whole set of 129. There's five guys out. This stuff that happened in our place is kind of made for television type. Step. Jailer Gary Ferguson tells me it began when an inmate had a medical emergency and another inmate asked to be moved. When the cell opened, Ferguson says Dixon and his 35-year-old cellmate, Kenneth Williams, used the broom handles to attack Sergeant John Parton and Officer Valerie Brock. They took advantage of their opportunity to do the cleaning to get the brooms and mops and whatever, and then they broke them and had them... Uh, Conceal. The inmates are accused of smashing phones and threatening to kill officers if they weren't let out. When Sergeant Parton pepper sprayed Dixon, Jailer Ferguson says Williams took the can and sprayed the sergeant back. Some other inmates apparently helped regain control of Dixon and Williams, preventing an escape. Both Dixon and Williams are set to be arraigned tomorrow morning. We're covering the news in Bell County from the LEX 18 Mobile Newsroom. Back to you.